it's a uh, it's a new formulation. So you, it's a new spin in an old one. So What's it called? This is a uh, zinc manganese uh, like battery. Mm -hmm. Here, um, like our company is Urban Electric Tower. Mm -hmm. So the idea is, you know, you have, you know, you have uh, the double A cells, like you know, you have them in your remote control, then mm -hmm. you throw them out at the end of the day. Uh, the reason that you can do that is because, well, one, they're cheap enough for you to check out after one use, mm -hmm. and two, they're pretty much environmentally benign. So when you throw them out, it doesn't really cause environmental impact. So we reformulate that. So there's no acid in there. What? There's no acid in it. No. Okay. None at all. Mm -hmm. uh, zinc and manganese. You can mm -hmm. find them in the backyard. Mm -hmm. the They're natural materials. Yeah. Yep. So uh, basically, what we've done is we formulated it so it becomes a secondary cell. We can get up to three thousand cycles mm -hmm. uh, instead of just one. Mm -hmm. And we've scaled it up for a grid scale application or like mm -hmm. a, like a UPS type application. UPS. Uninterruptible power supply. Ah. So if okay. your power goes out, then you can uh, get a ride through using a battery. Or if you just need off-grid power, mm -hmm. same thing. You, know, you can use it for solar, wind, whatever. Um, so, you know, like... Uh, Is there a coincidence as to why it happens to be a green case? Well, <laughs> you know, green is a very popular color these mm -hmm. days. It sure is. Um, so, yeah, like, so this cell, pretty much it's benign. Also, the processing of it, mm -hmm. you know, like, it's one thing to say, like, hey, it's a, like, you know, the battery's green, it's great for the environment, everyone loves that. Yeah. For, from our point of view, um, we need to scale up the technology, so when you do that, you do it at volume. Mm -hmm. And if it's hazardous material, there's a whole lot of hazmat overhead that goes into that. Like nuclear waste. Exactly. <laughs> like waste and also the handling of the material, mm -hmm. like the way it has to be treated. We don't need any of that. Yeah. It's like it's like almost like making like, you know, like trail mix or like uh snickers bars. It's yeah. like kind of processing. Yeah, I hear it. I hear it. So Okay. So you guys are called Urban Electric Power. Where where are you based? New York City. Okay. So, and you're not a for profit business? We are a for profit business. So we partnered up with Siemens and, I was gonna uh, ask you because I saw Siemens in the background there. Yeah, so Siemens is uh, developing a building management system. Mm -hmm. So pretty much during periods of time when uh, you know demand is high. You power these like the certain systems in the building off of the battery load, mm -hmm. and then when it drops down low, you uh, have to charge it. You have to know exactly when that happens mm -hmm. and what the different levels are and how to predict them. So they're working on modeling and the entire balance of systems really. So we would be developing the batteries like the full catered uh, energy storage system. Mm -hmm. You know, we stop at the breaker and then they pick up everything down the line from there. Okay. Okay, so there's a website where these these items can be seen also? Yes, urbanelectricpower.com. Oh, you're fortunate to get that. Yep, we did. Like, I was surprised. So and your name is? I'm Michael. Michael? Yep. Just like it says. Just like it says. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm gonna